terrible, wouldn't stay again. So much noise in the hotel at night, it was difficult to even sleep. Especially the sounds of the drunks returning puking, what sounded like everywhere. In this video, I will be going around to a one-star hotel to see if the reviews were actually accurate and the hotel was actually how the reviews made them out to be. Today, I'm going to be rating the worst rated hotels in London. And where else better to start than North London? I am at the Amos Hotel right behind me and it's a one-star hotel. If you want to see me make this a series and if you want to see me rate one-star hotels versus five-star hotels make sure you drop a comment in the comment section and drop a like so i know you want to see this series the only rule for this challenge is that i have to leave a five-star review in the one-star rated hotel but yeah it's gonna be hard but yeah we're gonna go so come with me you ready let's go it's the old school one so I've knocked and um, no one's answering. This is not a good start. Customer service is already a... Is, is there like a doorbell? There's no doorbell here. Maybe I have to go around. There's no entrance. How are we meant to get in? Already we're off to a bad start. I've knocked on the door, no one's answered. I can hear someone shouting Joe from a distance and I don't know who Joe is, but bro, this is insane. But yeah, I'm gonna call the hotel right now. Let them know I'm outside because no one wants to answer the door. Already, if you look at this hotel, bro, like it's not kind of, it looks kind of, hello? I have a booking at Amos Hotel and I'm outside. Um, I'm not sure if there's anyone inside, but I'm trying to get in and no one's answering the door. Single, yes. I'm outside number, there's no door number on outside. It just says Amos Hotel, 45, yeah, okay. Oh, it's here, okay, I see. We're coming up to get in. Oh yeah, I see it, I see it. But there's no numbers. Yeah, my palm on the door. Hold on, yeah. Oh, I'm in. Yeah, I'm in the building. Okay, so I have to go up two flights of stairs. Room number eight, okay, thank you very much. Bro, so we're in the hotel right now. And I can't lie, it's a shit hole. Carpet stairs. I can't lie, it's got, can you smell that, bro? It smells like cigarettes. It's got like a funny smell. Apparently, we've got room number eight, so we haven't got a room number three. We'll have to go up two flights of stairs, and the key is already, sorry, apparently it's already ready for us, so let's go, bro. I can't lie, this is mad. Oh my days. Is that a bullet hole? That's a bullet hole. That's come from a 44 cow. There's mold. Can you see the mold? Oh my gosh. We're up here, we're up here. You said two flights of stairs. We're not here. We're through here. I can't lie, this place smells so bad. Already, bro, it smells so bad. The lighting is bad. There's bullet holes in the wall. Oh my God. All right, cool. You ready, yeah? Let's go in. Holy shit. Nah. Is this what we're working with? Look, do you know he said the key's on the outside? The key's inside the room. Okay, so they're giving a look a Wi-Fi password. Okay, this is the key. I can't lie. This is very bad, but you know what? Yeah, they gave us tea. They gave us a little TV. All right, guys, let me be honest with you. The reason I did this is apart from the task, which I stated before, I'm bringing a girl here. Well, I'm gonna try to bring a girl here if she doesn't flop me. Now, I can make this like nice and pretty. They get me the roses on the floor leading to the bed. And then, you know, oh, I could do something with this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, shit, there's bed bugs. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now, they said there's bed bugs. Let's inspect the cleanliness of this room. Shit, what's this? Ah, right, cool, it's a bit of fluff, but it's not my fluff, so that's probably in my bed, but because I don't know whose fluff that is and we're in a the hotel, then that's a bit mad. Holy shit. All right, before I uncover the last part, let's look at the view. Stamford Hill at his best. This is the, this is what a view, this is Stamford Hill estate right there. Okay, it's a, not a nice, not a bad view. Can't lie though, this man needs to air out a bit still, I can't lie. I have to air out the room because it smells so bad in here. It smells like cigarettes. Comment down below, what do bed bugs look like? Uh, uh, uh. Oh, look at this. This is dirty. Hey guys, stop right there. Make sure you like the video, make sure you comment on the video, and make sure you subscribe to the channel. What are we doing? Okay, enjoy the rest of the video, bye. Nah, this mattress is knackered. I don't even wanna to touch it too much. What is that? This hotel is atrocious, man. I mean, 
Someone must have been painting on this bed. Because what is that? Hey, listen. We're going around London rating the worst rated hotels. Me and my boy behind the camera, we're going around the whole of London, checking out all these one star rated hotels rated by you, the people. Also gonna be doing one star versus five star hotel reviews. So, you know what I mean? If you want me to continue this series, make sure you smash a like on this video and make sure you comment down below. And uh, the secret word, for this video, it's five star. Everyone comment below five star if you want me to do one star versus five star. So we might do this versus the Shard. We might do this versus the Shangri-La. We might do this and the Corinthians. Is it Corinthians? You don't know, you know, you, you haven't been there. Trust me, I know about them ones. This one versus Corinthians Hotel, trust me. What did they say? They said, cool, I'm in my house and I couldn't even stay there because it was camping it out. Du -du 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 Corinthians. Du -du -du -du. Anyway, I'm waffling. But yeah, let me know, let me know, let me know. Yeah, does, does the TV work? That's one thing we didn't check, bro. Fuck it, I don't think it works anyway, man. But yeah, I think it's safe to say that I'm going to sleep here tonight. I'm going to do this bed, I'm going to stay here overnight, and then, um, yeah, I'll let you know how my sleep is. Yeah, this shower, I'm not even sure about the shower still. It's a bit dirty here still. I know what you're thinking, don't worry, they're gonna clean it. <laughs> Let's come out of here. Back in the five star hotel penthouse, we're in it. Let's come down the bed. Someone paid 90 pounds for this hotel. They stayed for two nights, because it's 45 pounds, I think. interesting night. I don't know how the girl is going to react when I bring her to this hotel, but it's all I can afford. So if she stays here, then she's a ride or die. I'm going to keep her for life. You heard it here. But there's a nice garden here. I can't lie. Nice garden. There's a nice garden here. Oh. Come out here with a babe, you know, chill, smoke a zoo, cigarettes, whatever you like. Actually, not, don't smoke a zoo. It's illegal. You can come out here, smoke a cigarette, enjoy the, you know, the nice you know what I mean? It's not bad. Nice little view of the, you get me the penthouses, you know? After that review, after that first initial review, what I can already say is that one, there's no bed bugs, two, the bathroom was dirty, two, the bedroom was dirty, and three, well, what did they say in the review? That it did smell. It did smell like cigarettes. Three, it smelled like cigarettes. And there was bullet holes in the wall, which it, it, I fear for my safety. I'd be so low. I fear for my safety. So um, we're gonna eat the Nando's that day, complimentary. I don't know how long that Nando's been there, but you know what I mean? I'm hungry, I gotta eat. I'm on a tight budget. So yeah, let's go get some food. Okay, so the light doesn't, oh wait, the lights are here. I have a toilet coming. Nah, this toilet is so small. What the fuck? Smells in here, man. What the fuck? Why's everyone really smell? Yeah, there's no light here, apparently. So we're in darkness right now. Sorry for the the quality of the video, but uh okay, so we've got some colour in here. For a little demo for one that. Do they have plastic? This is what we're doing for content, you know what I mean? If you appreciate me risking my health and my life content smash a like on this video because it's not easy you're not easy yeah okay okay does the toaster work wait does this kettle have lime skill let's find out holy shit I need to make a tea out of this. <laughs> what? Bro, that's lime skull, bro. Look at that. Nah, man. Mm -mm. You gonna make a tea, bro? No? Okay. That's for you. And um, this is for me. You wanna watch these first? 
as you guys can see in the video the whole tour wasn't that great i mean it was kind of impossible to complete this challenge with the rules that i had set at the start i mean it did look like a haunted house the carpet did smell there was a bullet hole in the wall the bathroom was dirty and the room wasn't the greatest but you know i stuck it out to the end and i completed the mission i stayed overnight so for me to give this hotel the most accurate review i can i'm gonna have to stay here overnight see how it feels see how the sleep is and in the morning when i wake up before i check out i'll leave an honest review Already customer service, there was no customer service, there was no concierge, there was no front desk, no reception. I had to call to check in and the guy over the phone directed me as to how to get in the door, blah 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 blah, blah I'm off here. Anyway, so I'll see you lot in the morning, I'm gonna go to bed and then um, yeah, I'll see you in the morning. and it wasn't as bad as i thought you know of course it wasn't the best sleep i've ever slept i still have some back pain but everything is okay finally my five star rating i mean it has a good garden where you can chill out relax eat some food with some friends maybe have a picnic but overall the view from the garden it wasn't it wasn't bad it was quite good the room reminds me to thank god for everything that i have you know guys making content like this can be hard sometimes i would appreciate if you all would smash a like on the video right now and make sure you subscribe to the channel for more content on the way let's try aim for hmm, 200 likes on this video if this video gets 200 likes we drop again next weekend hey guys stop right there